It feels great. I've been playing in the SCJ events for a long time, and obviously I've won a couple of team events with Mark Miller, which are also great. But to win an individual SCJ title is definitely the culmination of, you know, a, how long I've been playing in these events. And to win it here at Brookside on your home course, does that make it any more special? It does, actually. Um, I've been playing here for a long time, actually going back to when I was in high school. I played um, high school golf here, and so, yeah, I've, I've played here for, you know, 25 or 30 years. So it definitely, I had a home course advantage, obviously, but to also win here is special. A close uh, race coming down the, the stretch. Um, How would you feel going to the playoff hole? Actually, I didn't know how we were how we stood until I walked up and asked Giles on 18T, and he told me that uh, Kevin and I were both even. So I was thinking, okay, well, let's try to at least make par and make him beat me on 18. We tied, and then on the first playoff hole, I saw he was a little bit above the cup, so he didn't have the easiest putt, and I just wanted to try to hit something there as close as I could, and I actually hit a really good shot, probably the best shot I hit all day. Yeah, can you talk a little bit about that second shot on number one? Well, in the morning, I hit a terrible drive down the right tree line and clanked it off a tree and made bogey. So standing on the tee box, I really wanted to hit a good drive, and I made a good swing and left myself about 40 yards in. And that's a tough yardage for anybody, but especially for me. Um, so I opened the face a little bit and swung a little bit harder so that I could get some air under it because the pin was cut pretty close to that bunker. And like I said, just hit the best shot I hit all probably maybe all week. All right, well, congratulations again. Thank you very much. Appreciate it.